फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू बैंक एग्जाम कैफे इन एपिसोड नंबर टू वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस वन मोर केस स्टडी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द टॉपिक लीनियर इक्वेशन इन टू वेरिएबल ऑफ क्लास नाइन बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द नेक्स्ट केस स्टडी बेस्ड क्वेश्चन आई रिक्वेस्ट यू टू ज्वाइन माई टेलीग्राम चैनल the link of that telegram channel is provided in the description box below you can click and join the telegram channel where i always uh, publish the quizzes for class 9th and class 10th now let us move the question from linear equation into variables here is the question that car parking is a major problem in urban areas in both developed and developing countries In Jaipur city GT mall the parking charges of car in a parking lot is rupees 30 for first 2 hours and rupees 10 per hour for the subsequent hours answer the following questions on the above information friends here in a parking lot the charges are given as for the first 2 hours for the first 2 hours the charges will be rupees 30 and for the next 1 hour means subsequent 1 hour the charges will be rupees 10 this is the given information and with the information you have to answer the questions that are followed here so the first question is here on the screen that taking total parking time to be x hours the total parking time is x hour and the total charges are rupees y write the linear equation so the total time is x hour total time is what it is x hour for first 2 hours the charges are rupees 30 correct so for the first 2 hours the charges will be 30 now how many hours left for first 2 hour charge is 30 so the hours will be left x minus 2 hours so the remaining these hours the 10 rupees will be the charge per hour so that will be added to this first 2 hours charges that is 30 plus 10 into x minus 2 so this will be the charge for the subsequent hours and that hours are x minus 2 for every hour there will be a 10 rupees charge and for first 2 hours there will be 30 rupees charge and this total charge is given as rupees 50 so uh, sorry rupees y so which is equal to y now it is simple solve this equation and write it uh, in a standard form so it will be 30 multiply by 10 inside the bracket so it will be 10x Minus twenty, which is equal to y. So thirty minus twenty that will be ten, and take y to this side, and the equation will be what ten x minus y. Thirty minus ten that will be plus thirty uh, minus twenty that will be ten that will be uh, uh, which is ten which is equal to zero. So the equation you get as ten x minus y plus ten that is equal to zero. so which answer will be the correct answer that 10x minus y plus 10 that is equal to 0 so the b option is the correct option now let us move to the next question so the next question is that if y is equal to 20 then find the value of x now here you have got the equation and that equation is what 10x minus y plus 10 that is equal to 0 this is the equation you have got in the previous question so 10x minus y plus 10 is equal to 0 and here it is given that if y is equal to 20 then what is the value of x so simply put the value of y here in the equation and find the value of x so it will be 10x minus y is what 20 Plus 10, which is equal to 0. Minus 20 plus 10, that will be minus 10. So it is 10x minus 10, which is equal to 0. Take 10x to the other side. So it will be 10x, which is equal to 10, and therefore x is equal to 1. So you have got the value of x as 1, and therefore the equation, uh, therefore the option number 1 is the correct option. That x is equal to 1 when y is equal to 20. Now move to the next question. 
now the next question is that if x is equal to 2 then what is the value of y which is the same way that our equation is what 10 x minus y plus 10 which is equal to 0 and it is said that if the value of x the value of x is what it is 2 and you have to find the value of y so put the value of x as 2 that is 10 multiplied by 2 minus y plus 10 which is equal to 0 so 10 to the 20 20 plus 10 that will be 30 so minus y plus 30 that is equal to 0 so minus y which is equal to take 30 to the other side so it will be minus 30 so this minus and minus will be plus so y is equal to 30 so when the value of x is 2 when the value of x is 2 the value of y will be what it will be 30 so the option c is the correct option now move to the next question if the charges of the car parking lot is rupees 50 if the charges of a car in parking lot is rupees 50 and for the first two years hours so here the slight change is made in the question that the parking charge for the first two hours it is given as rupees 50 and for the subsequent hour it is 10 correct for the subsequent hour it is 10 here x we have taken as the total parking hours and y we are taking as a total charges correct so x is a total hours parking hours so out of this two hours will be charged as rupees 50 so for first two hours the charge will be 50 plus how many how much time is left now it will be x minus 2 because out of the total hours two hours is charged for of rupees 50 then remaining will be x minus 2 and that will be charged as rupees 10 so it will be 10 into bracket x minus 2 that is equal to total charge that is equal to y now solve this so it will be 50 plus multiply by 10 inside the bracket so it will be 10 x minus 20 which is equal to y so 50 minus 20 that will be 30 so it will be 10 x take y to this side so it will be minus y and 50 minus 20 that will be plus 30 which is equal to 0 so you get the equation 10 x minus y plus 30 is equal to 0 so it will be 10 x minus y plus 30 is equal to 0 and therefore the option a is the correct option now move to the next question the next question is that if the charges for the subsequent hour is rupees 8 per hour then write the linear equation friends here this is the same type of question just like of the first second question third question i hope you will be able to solve this so solve it yourself and write your answer in the um, so solve this question yourself and write your answer in the comment box and I hope you must have enjoyed this video. If yes, please like the video, share it with your friends and do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thank you very much.